hey guys okay so we only have like a week and a half left till school starts one thing i know for certain is that this week and a half left i want to make the maximum amount of stuff that i can make yesterday and the day before i was working on these roses uh this lilac beautiful lilac color with this sage green um stem color and i also used the same color for the little the green parts but yeah do you guys like my background i did this for another video still haven't posted it i mentioned it in the last three videos and still haven't posted this video because i'm just i'm too tired to <laughs> clean my entire room for this video that's a little hint but i don't know when that's actually gonna come out i think it's so cute this is the not the final because i know i have much more yarn to put up but that's for now this is gonna stay like this for now so yeah this is that's the progress that we have i'll show a couple clips from yesterday and the day before i don't know i was gonna do like a bouquet of 12 but i don't know if i like that anymore i think seven and then three and then maybe a single would be really nice for like variations uh for different sizes and different prices um, and I think it's so pretty. I think the cluster of three looks really, really nice. I finished all 12 and I don't think I've ever made this many roses at once of the same color so it looks really odd to me but I think when I put the wrapping paper and the leaves at the bottom of the roses I think it'll look put together but I'm not sure yet I think this is like what I'm going for but I don't know um if I'm gonna be able to but we're gonna try we're gonna try okay now that you're back to me I'm gonna start on a couple other things I want to piece together the last bit of these flowers and then amigurumi and like plushies because i got the five pound amount of polyfill so then it lasts me a bit and i want to make new things because i'm just obsessed with making more and new things so i think i want to do a couple hats a big variety a big variation of hats within these two weeks i'm just gonna do i'm gonna mass crochet a bunch of things and i'm gonna take you guys along with me it's gonna be a lot of footage but Hopefully, I can piece everything together. Why am I so shiny? Oh my god. This is what the cluster of three looks like, by the way. Maybe with a little tissue paper and a couple, like, leaves. It'd be promising. If it's like a... Here! Happy birthday! Or like a... Happy Valentine's Day! I don't know. We're in August. I don't know. Um, but maybe if it's for like a birthday or something small, some I uh, just because type of gift or whatever it may be. I think it's pretty perfect. We'll work it out. next week the club fair is next week um it is wednesday exactly a week from now is the club fair i have a bit of stuff so i don't really have to worry but i am scared that i might not have enough of the same thing just so during the period since it's going to be in the cafeteria during lunch periods i don't know if i'm going to have enough for each period you know so then no one misses out on like anything i'm going to definitely record then i'm sorry if they're faceless because i can't keep the hijab on all the time it's just too much on my hair, especially when I'm home because I'm usually outside with the hijab. The last clip was from last week and I did try to do stuff but instead I had to fulfill orders. And this is going to be the um, Lily of the Valley keychain type thing. And I also have two bags to make for that same order. Much love to Maria, but uh, other than that, 
we have to definitely definitely start on a couple things i have the hats from the previous tiktoks and uh youtube shorts if you guys have seen that two more cake boxes i want to make because i already have the blueberry one um from my last video so we're gonna make two more and that's gonna be it i'm gonna also take this little guy from my last video as well and she's gonna also go in the store and hopefully be sold i'm so excited i hope it goes well we have to also practice setup and pricing okay so first thing we have to do is figure out what i'm going to be selling so i have on my bed right now i have a couple things that are already done and then this is somewhat done this is also somewhat done and then these need completion this is what i'm in the middle of a rose that i made a long time ago actually some of these as well and those i made my previous short reel tiktok whatever i just want to freshen these up a little bit make sure they look good for anyone that wants to purchase them i'm using red heart super saver acrylic covering this wire that i have for all of them this is the bag that i used to have them in it's just a bunch of like uncompleted either like whips or things that i plan to make for this and and I just left it on the side for this purpose. This is also one of the bags that I made for this market, for this club fair. And I hope someone buys it, but I'm not sure. Okay, so I had to frog it a little bit because it was making this little point that I really did not like. So I frogged it a little bit and now I am threading my yarn through my needle in the hopes to make it a little more seamless. So then it looks like a little bit like this as much as possible. And then I'll pull it right when I'm done. Now we pull it. And see that now that's a lot more seamless. So now it doesn't even look like anything's there. So I just have to tie it and then tuck it in and then shove it inside. So now it'll be seamless. I don't know why I'm acting like it's a tutorial, but yeah, this, I just found a better way I had to do it. See, now look at that, nothing, that's so good. Okay, um, now it looks like a little, it's so cute. Now I just have to add the white wings and it adds a little bit of the actual bee character and it does look like it has stripes, so it just, it fits the theme. And um, I think this one might as well do this one too. Um, I already hot glued the eyes on, so it looks like this it is so cute okay and just to finish it off with the wings and everything look at them they're so cute i made this one a little bit fluffy with my dad's brush again don't tell him i use it <laughs> all i have to do is add the little keychains and these little guys are done but yeah i think i already have a lot of items from my previous stock that I could just use for the market. So I think I'm just gonna go along with that. And if I really want to make more or, and I feel like ambitious of them some sort, I'll make more, but I think I'm good for now. Out all on my bed, the pumpkins that I just did, um, the bandana, the bags, hats, and then a couple things from my stock. And I'm gonna make this one. It's another one of the cake boxes. Oh, this is a new variation. Um, I was going to make more flowers, but I think I might just make this one because this one's like already almost done. I don't know about this little guy. Hmm. I have a lot of those little guys and then everything that I showed previously. And then the little candy corn, another little bee. I think I have a lot, but I'm gonna make a couple more things just so I could show you guys. And then other than that, 
I think we're all set for the practice run of the market table because I don't know how it's gonna look and I have to figure out how to set these up before the actual day. I like the amount of sprinkles that are on here because I feel like it's like a lot but I think I could use this as maybe like the top of one of the boxes but um I don't know if I like it to make the entire thing like a cake but I think we should just trust the process because like imagine this is like a box okay and then it's not bad I realized that I made the entire thing in double crochets like the pattern but I made my last previous ones in uh, half double crochets and I like that one better and I have to undo this entire thing. Tomorrow is the club fair. I'm so excited. I already sent out the banner to my advisor so then they could print it out for the table. And I'm so excited it's gonna be so good um but to treat myself a little bit because my old crochet hooks are kind of mm, you know what i mean so i got me some new ones can you guess the color before i open it okay that's enough time okay well i guess you still have time Ta -da! it's pink they're so cute. Look at them. I got these from Amazon. The link will be in the description if you want to try them. The one I'm probably going to use the most is the most, most is 4.5 because that's the one I use the most. Let me know in the comments which hook is your favorite or the one you use most often. Look at her. I'm going to start working with this for the cow. I don't think I've explained what the cow is. Saturday, I'm going to be having a competition for Queens County uh, Museum, Farm Museum, Farm Fair, something like that. Um, and I have to enter my crochet, whatever. I think it's either clothing, tablecloth, or accessory. I'm going to be doing the accessory part. I'm going to be making a cow that can give birth yeah yeah it's i already ordered the pattern this is what it looks like and hopefully i could make it as close as possible because i took it to school and i want to show you guys what it looks like now where did my bag go okay so this is what it looks like so far i only made two of the legs and i'm doing the third but also i finished the button portion that one it kind of took a bit but in the tutorial they said to put clear ones i didn't have that one so i'm just gonna do this and see what happens but this is where, in theory, the baby would go. I still have to make the baby, so I'm so excited. But that's going to be really fun. And maybe I'll put in a little bit of a clip at the end um, on if I won, if I didn't, whatever. On to practicing the table arrangement because I still haven't started that. And that's going to be a little bit of a, a pickle because I don't know how it's going to go. So for this little guy, I have to make this uh, frosting around right here, a little bit of a ruffle situation. And then I have to glue this on, glue this on, and then it's going to be all done. It currently has my Lego pieces in there. It's okay. I'll take it out before I take it to school. I have actually calculated everything that I made. If we, in theory, sold everything that I made, we would sell $346 worth of stuff which is obviously the goal. Half of the profits that we made from that, half of it goes to me and half of it goes to the club. So then we could buy yarn and crochet hooks and like gifts and kits for, um, kits, not kids, um, for, oh my gosh, for the people that are joining the club so then they could learn and be motivated with, you know, basically free stuff to them. Yeah, now, now for real, actually on to practicing the arrangements. Ignore the mess, but it worked. The rocks did hold up all of them. I think it looks pretty nice, but I don't know. It's kind of pissing me off. I'm obviously gonna take this off. 
but I think I might want to decorate this or like make it black or something. But it's a good starter maybe. I don't know if I'm gonna use it or like find something else, but that's the current solution. Okay, it's the day of the actual event and I already did my face makeup. Now time for the clothing. Okay, ignore the mess because I still have my laptop out because I still have to do my sign up sheets and I have to print out my flyer for my Instagram and stuff. Um, I'm so nervous guys. I'm gonna do a little bit of a touch up before I head out. I'm so nervous. I think I might have done a little too much. But hey, the more the merrier, because hey, if I have too much, if I have too much, that's basically stock for next next time's market, or if I have something else where I'm able to sell. Like, obviously, it's not all about the sale, and it's not all about me selling and making money for myself, but more of getting money for the supplies, so then you could teach people in our club. Because whose pocket is that going to come out of? Because there's obviously going to, we have to get hooks. We have to get yarn. We already have donated yarn, but we, we need a specific type for specific projects. You know what I mean? So the hope for today is to at least get a little bit of an incentive on what we're going to be able to buy for everyone. So then we don't disappoint. You know what I mean? I currently have my large bag. I don't know how I'm gonna carry this, but my large bag, that's that's one. And then I have my crochet bag, where I'm gonna have my little crochet stuff so then when I'm bored or no one's at the table, I can just pull, out, pull it out and crochet. I'm gonna be doing the cow so then I can get that done before Saturday. I've been waiting for this for so long, so it just doesn't feel like it's today. But I think the time that I go to school and sit at my table it's gonna be it's gonna be real so. yeah i have to print out my flyer and a couple sign up sheets for people who are gonna sign up and hopefully it's a good amount so then we can have an idea of how much we buy perfect that's perfect yeah i'm thinking out loud here because if i don't think out loud i'm just not gonna think about it at all well not, I, I will, but it won't be as thorough you know but i will record trust me i have to get everything i'm gonna look for the setup try to tell you guys at least about every other sale or every sale so then um, I can still engage with people but also engage with you guys. Wait the fit guys, wait the fit. This is the crochet thing I made so I'm, you know, crochet skirts. Ignore the mess, please. These are my heart pants, my heart jeans I got from Shein. I made this and then the top underneath it is just like a solid white, white shirt. I don't know where I got it. Um, I think I got this from Egypt. I'm not sure, but you can get it here anywhere. Uh, Amazon, anywhere literally on Jackson Heights or Hillside. Um, I also made this and in the cap I stole from my mother. Oh, jewelry, Shein, Shein. Birthday, also Shein, also Shein. I got it myself, so let's leave. <laughs>
other than that fat nap I just took on the bus and this two huge bags of stuff. Well, this one's not that bad. Today was such a success. When I get home, I'm gonna count up everything and see how much uh, we made it as a whole. Okay, I'm not sure, but if my calculations are correct, I made 146 in sales, but 73 in profit. So half of the 146 goes to the club and the other half goes to me. That was really, really successful um, as a whole, not just to me, but since the other officer, she made 126, so 63, 63, half for her, half for the club. And then I made 146 which is 73 73 this is the added calculation for the club and our profit is our profit but it's okay like um i know some would say that's like not successful but it's better than nothing because like etsy is hard to do when you don't have that big of an audience which i'm thankful for every single one of you but when it comes to small businesses it's really hard to put it out there and stuff so go check out my etsy but i'm gonna definitely put it in my savings and not use it and i'll try to make my products my quality of my videos and everything better through those savings i'm gonna finish the cow hopefully today or tomorrow because i have to hand it in on friday and then i think i will show you guys like a little clip of that but i will start editing this now so then it'll be out as soon as possible thank you guys so 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 much for watching i hope you have a great rest of your day and i'll see you guys next time make sure to smile it's done also i may have spent 12 dollars already because um i i bought this from the other officer her link will be in my description because it is so cute um, I'm gonna definitely use this for a bunch of my little things when I need it uh, in a little pouch. Look at how cute! I just want to support her as well, so I bought this little pouch from her. Her Instagram will be in the link in my description. Please, please go check her out. She was so amazing and she helped so much when it came to the club fair. And the other five I spent on boba as a reward for me, but oh, I deserved it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> Bye.